trying to look back I'm just trying to move in the shadows Yesterday, tomorrow I'm searching for a way I can't tell the difference Between you, between me And search for an answer I can't tell the truth Hello, my friends! My name is Eugene and welcome back uh, to another video here on the channel. I hope you're having a great day. Thanks for joining me. Uh, but you know what time it is. It's jingle time. A random game is chosen for me. What, what will it be? Who knows? Oh, well, let's see what the random number generator has in store for us today. Hmm. Here we are back with our Amazon games library. Uh, positively, I don't even know how, you know, I don't, I've never even counted. I'm not sure how many there actually are in here, but plenty of hidden gems as we found on the previous three episodes of this series. I bet a card showed up right now. Click on it if you've missed out. All right, random number generator. 1 through 27, 1 through 26 being letters of the alphabet, and 27 being symbols. So let's see where the where the numbers take us this time. 25. So that's Y. Okay. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I have played some of these in this category before. Ah, uh, but let's see, let's see what number we get out of one through five. Okay, one through five. Two, I think if I remember correctly, that was one of the ones I haven't played. Yono and the Celestial Elephants. Well, that just sounds adorable. Let's turn off here, let's go full screen. What's Yono about? Yono and the Celestial Elephants is a grand adventure featuring carefully designed puzzles, treasure hunts, a sprinkling, a sprinkling combat. Maybe a sprinkling of combat and a world full of people. Sounds positively delightful. I hope there are puns. I guess we'll see. All right, well, this is gonna take a quick second for me to install, but you don't have to worry about that because you'll be right back into the video right about now. Welcome back. Well, immediately, this is delightful. I don't quite know what's happening on this title screen, but it's really cute. <laughs> anyway. Before we get going on the game, uh, YouTube does want me to remind you uh, to subscribe, ring that bell, like this video, leave me a funny comment, or just about, you know, how bad I am at games, because that is also true. But thanks for going on this journey with me. I'm just going to press start game. Let's go. New game. Six, seven, eight, nine. It's an elephant. It's adorable. Oh, celestial elephants. I got it. So are we born from the, the, the sky? Oh. Hi, I'm Sundara. Sundara? Oh, geez, I hope I'm saying that right. Oh, and her adorable little character portrait. Let me see. I bet I need to move myself somewhere. Hold on two seconds while I move myself the heck out of the way so you can see all the adorableness. Hi, I'm Sundara. I saw you fall from the sky. What kind of thing are you? 
Well met, Santara. My name is Yono. I'm an elephant. <laughs> well, very matter of fact about it, Yono. I'm a human. Nice to meet you. I'm on the lookout for an adventure, which is why I'm out here in the wilderness. And I saw this big shiny star fall from the sky, and I figured that could be a good place to look. That's how I found you so quick. That's what I'm here for, too. I am ready for an adventure. There's a small village just up ahead. It's called Wind Hill. That's where I was when I saw the star. Come on, I'll take you there. Follow me. I'm adorable. Look at me go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at me go. Oh, this is, this is adorable. Okay. I'm not going to get over that run cycle this entire, uh, this entire playthrough. Oh, I didn't do that. I didn't run in the wall. I don't know why that happened. Anyway, moving on. Headbunt. Headbutt, headbutt, use trunk. Oh, I can, oh, I get it. Interact, target lock, okay. Well, well, come on, I'm no. <laughs> can I use my trunk on the turtle? Well, I'm glad I don't really have to demolish the turtle. That's good. Uh, secret forest jar shrine. Please don't lift my jars. Please don't stand in front of them and press your interact button. They break easily. Thank you for your concern. Oh, I haven't even taken a second to appreciate the music. I love this. <laughs> These big boulders are blocking the path. I just jumped over them before, but maybe you will want to find another solution. No offense. I wager even rocks like these are no match for that mighty skull of yours. I'll see you down the road. Try to keep up. Oh. Well, that was a little frightening, but... Oh. <laughs> oh, very crunchy sound effect for that. Wow, you really pulverized those boulders. How strong are you? Elephant strong. <laughs> I don't know what the joke was there, but that wasn't it. Look, don't boo. I hear you booing on the... Just leave me a comment. Don't, don't click off the video, please. <laughs> You really pulverize those boulders. How strong are you? I bet you can push this big heavy box around like it was nothing. Just keep walking right into it for a while until it starts moving. Ready to put your, really put your back into it, you know? Personally, I can't even budge it. Well, I'll run ahead. Don't dawdle. Okay. Oh. oh. I'm moving it down here. Okay. Okay, and then I just walk across. Perfect. I'm figuring this stuff out. <laughs> Look at all these dandelions. Don't you just want to blow them all? Kaplooey! Kaploofy! Kaploofy. And I mean, your nose is huge. Just imagine what a mighty gust you could whip up with that thing. Anyway, we're not far from Wind Hill now. Just a bit more. I'll meet you again when we get there. So long. Oh, is that a pun? Is that a pun? Am I going to have to add a pun counter somewhere? Oh, but you can blow the items around. Well, that's a little unfortunate. I'm collecting 31 of whatever this currency is. Oh, I want to have pinwheel controlled. Man, why, why hasn't you? Oh, that's a terrible sound effect. I'm too close to it. Why hasn't humanity advanced to where we have pinwheel controlled? I don't know. Conveyor belts. 
I'm a little sad that we haven't uh, progressed to that. <laughs> progressed to that yet. Okay, push this down here. Perfect. Will gallop? Do elephants gallop? Really, no. We'll uh, gallivant our way over. Okay. Oh. Perfect. Oh. Uh, interact. You found a health token. Collect four of these and take them to the, your nearest health token exchange service to trade them in for an extra heart container. Perfect. Oh, am I stuck here? Okay. Hoping I wasn't gonna get stuck this soon. I didn't know if my elephant would take fall damage or not. It seems like an elephant would take fall damage, but maybe not. Yay, you made it all the way. I knew you would. Windhill is right here. It's just a small village, nowhere near the size of Nightingale City, where I'm from. It's a cute place, though, and it's quiet, peaceful, and remote. Just the thing if you find that you need to disappear for a little while. I mean, you're kind of from Nightmare City, but we won't, we won't talk about that. I'll make my way back to Nightingale City eventually, but for now, I'm loafing around in these parts of the world. By the way, don't be shy to go and talk to people. That's really the best way to learn about, learn more about what is going on around here. And don't hesitate to talk to the same person several times either. I find that most people just love the sound of their own voices and almost everyone has many interesting things to say if you just prod them a little. I don't know if that's good advice for real life, but that's great video game advice. <laughs> I myself have been bothering every stranger I've met all the way from Nightingale City. Of course you had, Sundara. <laughs> Of course you have. This way to Wind Hill, a small village with a big wind obsession. Is that a fart joke? Did this game just make a fart joke in my presence? Wind Hill. Something is scribbled beneath the name. Uh, Yingrid was here. I, I don't know who Yingrid is yet. Hello, m sir or madam. I'm not quite sure yet. Good day. Oh, hello there, little one. You startled me. Pray tell, what exactly are you? Some sort of animal? I'm terribly sorry to ask. I if it is rude, I mean. It's just, you may very well be the first four-legged creature I have ever talked with. Uh, it it's quite all right, ma'am. I am an elephant. An elephant, you say? How... Curious, I have never even heard of elephants before. I have come to help people and do my best to bring joy to the world. Well, that sounds positively splendid. Welcome to Windhill, little elephant. Our village is not big, but it is quite charming, wouldn't you say? I think you can make many new friends here if you just take a look around. Well, now, I've been told to talk to the same person multiple times. Here in Wind Hill, we take great pride in our wind-powered lifestyle. Here, everything runs on the energy from the wind. Okay, a fart joke unconfirmed at this time. I'm suspicious. I'm a little sus, as the kids say, but uh, checks out thus far. Oh, and I can move the camera with the right stick. Okay, good to know. <gasps> I am just looking for an excuse to sneak off to my chic... Oh, no. The secret jar shrine in the forest. Okay, now that seems like... Hmm. Is that person wearing an, like an astronaut helmet? Did you know that the Makani built a whole network of subterranean railroads, railways all over the kingdom? One day I'm going to ride the train all the way to Nightingale City, but I'm too small to ride that far. Can the railroads take you anywhere? Yes, all the major cities and lots of other places as well. But you'll have to visit the cities first by yourself before you can take a train there. 
That's why I'm not allowed to ride. Yet. In the meantime, I wear my trusty adventure helmet. Please. Kiddos are interesting. Okay, I'm supposed to talk to you again. When I grow up, I want to travel all over the world and write articles and books about all the places I visit. People always talk about how grand a Nightingale City is. Personally, I find it hard to believe that any place could be bigger than Wind Hill. See, that seems to be a... If I, um, keep my... Well, I'm gonna try and figure out what the problem is. It feels like if... I'm touching the control stick at all while exiting a door. I I run. I just keep running, which is a bit of a problem. <laughs> just like Link, no one uh, no one stops us. Though I, in fairness, if an elephant came into my home and started throwing my jars, I probably would just let it happen too. I feel maybe Link you could reason with. I don't know that you can reason with Yono. Even if I am adorable. Help me, my scientific experiments seem to have attracted a whole lot of Snokes. Professor, it is 2023. I don't, am I, I don't, I, am I allowed to say that? I don't, I don't think I'm allowed to say that. Professor, come on, it is 2023. They have invaded my cellar and I can't go down there anymore. Maybe I can help you clear them out? Oh, could you? They're a nasty little creature. They are nasty little creatures, but they are not very dangerous if one is careful. If you find any treasure down the cellar, you can keep it as a reward for helping me with the Snoke problem. Still unclear if I can say that or not. <laughs> All right. I could study this map for hours. Windhill, Nightingale City, the Sunder Garden, and Freehaven, it's all there. There should be a map like this in every town, and we just received one in here in Windhill. Okay, can I look at it? Oh, this is a, okay. Oma's Peninsula, Acorn Woods. I don't know how far we're gonna get in this video here today, but I'm gonna do my best. This is really adorable. I find this, I find Yono remarkably adorable. I, uh, Yono would make the perfect plush. And hopefully, <laughs> and hopefully it makes that noise when you pick Yono up in plush form. Oh. Wait, were they just snakes? And I was misreading snake as Snoke? Wait, we're gonna have to go back and read that. <laughs> Was that an A and I was reading it as an O? Now I'm not sure. Now I'm doubting myself. Maybe editing Eugene can fill me in here. A health token. Perfect. Did he just say snakes and I was... Oh. Now I'm doubting myself. Hold on. No, it clearly says Snokes. Snokes are a member of the uh, Vip Viperidae family, but they are not venomous to humans. They are, however, known to be very aggressive, even towards creatures much larger than themselves. One single Snoke is easily dealt with, but they, are, they often group together in larger numbers, and this can make them quite dangerous. A group of Snokes is called a pit. Okay, just, I just wanted to be clear. He was calling them Snokes, which I need to stop saying. I feel like I'm gonna get banned on this platform if I keep saying that. Okay. Um... You know, I, I'm, I'm fascinated that I don't take fall damage as an elephant. I really thought that would be an issue. Windhills Candy Pirate Club. No grown-ups allowed. 
If you can get past our obstacles, you will find our treasure. Okay. Well, I can, I'm good at puzzles. <laughs> Fast forward to two minutes later when I have no idea how to solve the puzzle. Okay, well we go, looks like we go up and then to the left here. Perfect. Hopefully there are no Snokes here. I need to stop saying that immediately. <laughs> okay. Uh, throw these pots. I'm collecting whatever this, I don't know, copper looking currency is uh, down there. I love this. This is adorable. Wait, how do I, wait, I want the things. How do I get the, oh, can I, oh. How do I, huh, oh, almost, a little more, huh. Oh, they disappeared, gosh dang it. All right. Okay, before I fall down here, let's see what the other direction has. It looked like this was an exit out. I don't know where this is yet. Oh, never mind. Uh, huh. Elephant. Okay. But I need that block there. Okay, I think we can do this. Down. Push it over, okay. This reminds me of, uh, not in this perspective, uh, but I, I used to play something like this on my TI-81 calculator. Was it called block it or shove it? It was called something. I remember playing it before a geometry class. That pickup sound effect. See, Link needs a, a, a fun pickup sound effect like that. Okay, here we are. Oh. Up. Another health token. All right, we're, we're, we're getting these in a hurry. Okay. Well, I'm glad I went this way. So let's fall back the other way. An elephant our way this way. Do elephants gallop? I only associate horses with galloping. Do, do elephants gallop? I don't know if that's the right term. Oh, I don't have to pick them up. I can just headbutt them. I guess I can't do anything with these big uh, barrels just yet. Despite the fact that I can smash through solid rocks, barrels seem beyond my ability. Oh. <laughs> who are you? Oh. The old man who lives down over there is so, so scary. He's the village undertaker and, and, and he's a zombie. A zombie? What do you mean? I mean, he's not alive. He's no less a corpse than those he has undertaken to undertake. He's wearing a long black cloak. His hands are cold as the breath of death and his face is as white as bone. He gives me the heebie-jeebies. What are you doing here by his house then? I want to get a good look at him. Of course, this is so exciting. Okay. Is this, this is home? Very uh, cheery home to be living in as a zombie. You would think, I don't know, brain decor. Oh no, that, that's, uh, she was not lying. She was absolutely not lying. Hello, strange, can I, can I do my skeleton? Hello, stranger, you are new to these lands. 
Uh, yes, yes, I, I am. In fact, I just landed. I have never seen an elephant before. They say it's an omen of good things to come for both the living and the dead. I am one of the Bone Whites. We are the talking remains of the long time dead, eternally enjoying the beauty of this world. I have never met a dead person before. How come you do not lie buried in the ground yourself? It is because of the Sunder Garden. Hundreds of years ago, a battle took place in the fields that are now called the Sunder Garden. The two armies were the largest the world had ever seen, and so equal in strength that not one of them could defeat the other. The bloodbath lasted for days until not a single warrior was left standing. There was no victor. But the dead bodies of the warriors sank into the earth like seeds, and these ancient cadavers are now sprouting bone whites like me. We spring from the ground like flowers that exist in this world without aging or dying. The Sunder Garden is our home. It sounds like a place of it sounds like a place of wonder. Yono, I'm not sure that's true. <laughs> The sacred cemetery is the most beautiful place on this earth. Hey. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay. So she wasn't kidding. I thought maybe she was just exaggerating. Perhaps the... That's, that's just a robot. Perhaps the undertaker was just misunderstood. But no, she was exactly accurate. Good day, sir. My, aren't you a strange creature? If you don't mind me asking, sir, what exactly are you? I am an elephant. My name is Yono. You're a pretty strange one yourself. Oh, not at all, sir. I am a Makani. I come from the robotic city-state of Freehaven. If you are wondering what I am doing down here in Windhill, sir, the answer is that I am on vacation. <laughs> Do you want more of that voice? <laughs> Did you know, sir, that Freehaven was founded by the Makani almost 300 years ago? It is our glorious city-state, and we are even governed by our own robotic laws. Freehaven is still part of the kingdom, mind you, sir, and subject to the human queen. That's why I can travel all the way to this picturesque little village without any passport or anything. What a time to be alive. This was a triumph. Making a note here. Huge success. Oh, where am I going? Okay. Oh. Can I talk to the... Oh. 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 What to do? What to do? Oh, what? What, what are you? I am an elephant. I've come to this realm to help the people in need. Why, that is certainly grand, for I am indeed in need. Do you see my crops over there? I just can't get them to grow. Why not? What do you need? Beats me. Maybe they just need some water. It has been rather dry as of late. Maybe you could find a tub of water somewhere and fill up that prolonged proboscis of yours. These people are very... These people are very forward with an animal they've never met before. I mean, I would never drop prolonged proboscis until at least the fourth date. Uh, that, that certainly sounds like a job for me. I'm on it. I mean, no questions asked, huh? Oh, it's cuckoos. Can I headbutt the cuckoos? I can. Doesn't seem to do anything. Good day. I'm a traveling margil. <laughs> Eugene can't read. Good day. I'm a traveling marble merchant. I sell marbles. That's very nice. How is business going? Not good at all. I put down the merchandise for a short while, and now I can't for the life of me remember where I put it. Well, uh, rule number one, uh, don't put down the merchandise. Have you lost? Oh. Y Yon.
You know what you've done. You know what you've done. I knew there were going to be puns in this game. Uh, I, you can read what's on screen. I. Yes, I have. I can't find them anywhere. I'll help you look. You will? Yes, I'm an elephant. I'm here to bring peace and harmony and to help anyone in need. I will find your marbles for you. Thank you very much. What's happening over here? Oh, ahoy, ahoy. That's ahoy. Ahoy there, Yono. Look at this sleeping boy I found. Can we keep him? Sundara, we can't just, we can't just kidnap children. Judging from his close and shaved head, I'd wager he's a monk from the temple in the city. But we can hardly be more than a novice. And that makes me wonder what he is doing all the way out here. Or perhaps what he should be doing instead of dozing off. Wouldn't it be hilarious to wake him up in a really startling fashion? Maybe I should yell really loudly in his- Sundara, you're a menace! No, wait. Let's bash a bucket of water in his face. That would certainly be a right laugh. Don't you think he'll be upset? Look at it this way. He is most likely here in Windhill for a reason. Some pilgrimage or mission or something. And if that is the case, he probably shouldn't be sleeping like this in the first place. In fact, I bet he'll be thankful if you wake him up. All right. <laughs> so someone needs water. Someone's losing their marbles. This might be a barber shop with the... Oh, no, it's like a record store. Oh. Welcome to... Oh, no, it is a barber shop. Mithandra. Mithranda. Mithranda. Welcome to the Wind Hill Barbershop. What can I do for you today? Something cheerful and light, or maybe you're looking for something that brings out the mystery in you. Oh. Why am I just spinning on a record? Oh, I can buy different, well, that's a pretty cool skin. Okay, I can buy different skins here. Well, I don't know if I really want the yellow fant. Last Nomad. Oh, I wonder what that is. <laughs> Well, that's a, that's subtle. White elephant, chest master scarlet. Ah. Oh, I like the what's the festival one look like? That's kind of cute. Zigzag purple. I do like that cosmic one. Well, maybe I'll save my coins. So let's stay with baby blue original for now. Uh, did I go in this shop? Don't know. Definitely went in there. That's the train station. Have I gone in here? Oh, well, hello. Welcome, adventurer. This is your health token exchange service speaking. Well, I don't have enough yet. Health tokens are extra heart containers. Yeah, I don't have enough yet. All right. Thank you, though. Good to know. I can go there. Okay, this I exited out of. This is where this, okay. This was the, the professors, okay. So this isn't a huge map. Okay, so then let's, I think there was one other way to go. So let's look down there if I can find something. Oh, here we go, here's water. Do I, how do I, how do I do it? Water. Oh, now I have water. Okay. Oh, and there's the marbles. Oh, we need a little more water. Okay. All right. This is very cute. Oh. I have to push the marbles? I can't just take them? Oh, well, I pushed them the wrong way. What do I do? <laughs> Do I get larger when I'm filled with water? This is a this is really adorable. I kind of love this. This is really adorable. Okay.
Yay, there we go. Oh. oh, I found, there's that health token. Okay. Ah, you did it. You made all my plants grow. That was certainly the most glorious display of nose action I have ever seen. These people are remarkably forward. At least since my grandma sneezed that one time. I, I, I want to hear that story. <laughs> What's the story there? Oh, nothing in here. Okay, well, we'll, we'll break the pots. Hopefully it'll reset the position of the marbles. Oh, there we go. I don't know why that wasn't working before. Perfect. Let's deliver the marbles to this man. Oh, oh look, you found my lost marbles. Fantastic. Now I can go right back to business. How can I ever repay you? Not necessary at all. I'm happy to help. You deserve a reward. I'll give you 300 coins. What do you think about that? Please keep your money. As an elephant, I'm just here to help. I don't want anything in return. I'm just doing what I'm here to do. Really? Elephants are truly magical. It's nice to have one walk the earth again. It's been ages since the last time there was an elephant. Oh, is this like some post-apocalyptic, we've hunted all the elephants and now they're all gone kind of world? You know what I will do? I will travel to Nightingale City and donate the coins to the monks at the temple instead. That sounds like a very good idea. Fantastic. Thanks again, Mr. Elephant, for all your help. I'm so happy you are here. Just wait until the people in the capital city hears about your arrival. Just wait until the people in the capital city hear about your arrival. All right. Do I really have to spray water in this poor guy's face? Let me do this instead. Oh, this is just... The girl that's scared of the scared of the uh, Undertaker, the Bone Mancer, Bone Bone White. There it is. All right, let's get a little more water and spray it in someone's face, because boy, that's just how I want to be woken up. <laughs> An elephant spraying water in my face. Nothing better. Nothing better. Lumpity lump. Kabam! What? What's going on? I'm, I'm, oh, is he? What's going on? I'm awake, I'm awake! Hello there, sleepyhead. My name is Sandara, and this is my friend Yono. He's an elephant. Hi, Sandara. I'm pleased to meet you. My, my name is Kai, and, and, wait, did you say elephant? Ivory above, you really are an elephant. You have the trunk and the ears and everything. I can't believe my eyes. Believe it, Buster. He looks just like that big statue in the town square. And it is true. All of it. That means these are blessed times indeed. I'm, I'm glad my presence means so much to you. I wouldn't exactly say it means everything. Most people nowadays regard elephants as creatures of myth, if they know of you at all. There have been over a thousand years since the world was last visited by an elephant, and the memories from those times have transformed to fancy legends and fairy tales. The temple in Nightingale City is trying to keep the old traditions alive, but we are only a handful of monks nowadays. And desperate enough to initiate just about anyone, it's Sundara. Sundara, come on. <laughs> chill, Sundara. I don't know if you have a crush, but chill. Chill it down. <laughs> Ha ha ha! Sundara, that wasn't a very nice thing to say. It's it's true, though. I was sent here to win the hill on a mission, though what that mission is was never really specified. I suspect they just wanted me out of the temple for a while, after the incident with the tapestry, and the soup, and the cat, and the ancient vase. Oh man, I wish I could have seen that. But I'm glad I'm here now, and get to see Yono the Elephant with my own eyes. I must guide you back to Nightingale City. 
How surprised the other monks will be when I, the lost, oh, the lost hope. Oh, Kai. <laughs> You're making me sad, Kai. Uh, turn back together with the next elephant. I'm from Nightingale City as well. And that's where all the real action is. Now that Yono is here, we should totally spread the good news to all the people of the kingdom. Okay. We'll head north from here through Hedgehog Forest. Do we gotta go fast? Asking for a friend. <laughs> Come on, let's go already. Okay. Oh, Kai. <laughs> All right, let me exchange uh, for the heart container without killing any chickens. Welcome to the hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, let's have it. Thank you. All right. We're heading to the hedgehog forest. This is really cute. I'm glad I'm playing this today. This is... This is really adorable. Here we are. Oh, I keep head. I'm sorry. Normally I think it's A to interact. I'm just headbutting everybody. You better watch out, Yono. There are a couple of rob goblins. See, all of these sound like things I shouldn't be saying. There are a couple of rob goblins. Well, probably if I say it like that, it doesn't make it better. <laughs> There are a couple of rob goblins down in the valley, and they seem to have blocked the path with a fire. Rob goblins? What are they? Predatory and aggressive little scavengers. Because of their weapons and armor, they look a bit like people, but they're really not. It's Sundara! <laughs> We're already making creatures less than people? This world might have just more than a lack of elephant problem. Uh, they're just attracted to metals and will carry around anything they can find, steal, or plunder. They are just like what my mom says our lives would be without a structured society. Nasty, brutish, and short. <laughs> I don't, I don't, social commentary, maybe. Ever since I can remember, I've always want, I have always, oops, I've always wanted to believe in the stories. That's why I became a monk in the first place, to learn more about the mythical elephants who came to our world every millennium to restore balance and harmony in a realm of chaos. And now you are here, which confirms my beliefs and brings a purpose to my whole life. I was so lost. I'm terribly sorry for the state of the world, Yono. There are rob goblins all over the place, and it's a real hassle to travel between cities. I'm afraid you'll have to see a fight or two before we reach our journey's end. I'll certainly do my best. I have faith in you. Well, obviously. <laughs> uh, but you know what I mean. Oh, I thought that was the rob goblin. What is this? Oh, it's a hedgehog. It's a hedgehog. Oh, that's so cute. Throw it. It lives there now. <laughs> oh. There we go. Uh, sorry, hedgehog, if this is yours. Uh, I'm kind of stealing from the hedgehogs. Hedgehog! It'll move again, right? It'll move again, right? I kind of deserve that. Okay. Okay, good. They, they, okay, good. Good. They're fine. They're fine. All right. 
There's a fire, so we're not going that way. Uh, oh, I can put out the fire. Okay. That's fine. Let's do that. I'm an elephant. I love how I get wide when there's... When I'm filled to the brim with water. That's very cute. Perfect. What do we got here? Uh, by the Queen's orders, Hedgehog Tunnel has been filled with traps. This is an attempt to keep the Rob Goblins out. Please proceed with caution. Okay. Okay, they're all they're all at least timed. They're appropriately timed. I'm sorry, whoever's vases these are, though. I do apologize. Snock, snocks? Well, oh, no, I can't. What were these called? <laughs> Snokes? Snokes. Oh. oh. There we go. <laughs> uh. It's an adorable sound effect. They do, like, scream and explode rather violently. I will say that. Sounds like I'm really hurting them, which, you know, is fine. They are Rob Goblins. And though they look like people, evidently, according to Sundara, they are not people. Why am I here? Get water? Wait, why did I do this? Oh, because I need... Oh. Here we go. Okay. There we go. Oh, rude. Oh, and that's where I need the water. Okay. Get some water. Is that a toilet flushing sound effect? Oh, <laughs> okay. It's over there now. There's another way to go. Let's, let's go that way first before we proceed through this door. is over here. Oh, perfect. Well, hey. Exploring is rewarding. Wish I had a better sense of how to knock those off the shelf. I wonder if I get maybe like a charged up headbutt at some point. I did get him to break that one time. Maybe that was a fluke. Maybe that wasn't supposed to happen. Chest up there. Let's work our way around, see what we can find. Uh, the craft, oh my gosh. Eugene can't read. The cable raft system is out of order during low tide. Sorry for the inconvenience. Ah. Let's 
So what does that mean? Oh, I'm gonna have to supply the, the tide. I get it. I get it. Okay. So let's... Then we supply the tide. Perfect. There. Okay. Give me water. Give me food. Give me fire. Give me that which I desire. Not so much. I need water again. Come back. Come back, water. Thank you. I'm glad they keep spinning after you run out of water. That That is pretty nice. Snake. Snake. Break some rocks. See what's in here. A good another health token. Lovely. Hi, hedgehogs. Oh, well, this is just very enjoyable. Oh, it's our... It's our train friend. <gasps> Hello! Bet you didn't expect to meet me here. Can you guess how I got here? I snuck on a train and rode it all the way to this weird tunnel. It was awesome! It was the best! I'm glad to hear that, but this tunnel is full of traps and rob goblins. It could be dangerous. Yeah, I know. I'm not really going to venture further into the tunnel. I just wanted to ride the train. I'm going to sneak back onto one and go home to Wind Hill again. By the way, do you want me to tell you something about trains? I know a lot about trains. Okay. Whenever you arrive at a new place, it's a good habit to seek out and check in at the train station so you can quickly travel there again in the future. That's all for me. Time to ride the train back to Wind Hill. Okay, so do I need to... Well, how adorable is this? Oh my gosh, there's so many train stations. <laughs> Goodness. Well, that animation was adorable. I don't, it happened so fast, my brain didn't really have time to register. Let's look at it again. Adorbs. Another health token. We're finding these in a hurry. Okay. Anything this way? Just lots of lots of jars to break. Alright. Well at least they keep nice carpets for the hedgehogs? Do hedgehogs desire plush carpeting? Not sure about that one. Nope, did that hit me? Okay, I'm ready for it this time. Oh, I thought it went twice, okay. Here, here. Here. Not too bad. Is this just a way back or is something actually hidden here? Oh no, just a way back. Okay. Just a way back if we needed it. Keyhole. Looks like the key was oh just right here. Okay. But, uh... The run is is so adorable. That's kept me hooked this whole time. Oh. 
we go. Sometimes the interact button's a little finicky, but that could have been, that was probably user error. All right. Uh, okay, that one opens the door. What's this one? Uh... Okay, it stops immediately when you step off. Figure out what I'm doing over here. Is there another? Oh, <laughs> almost fell right in. Uh, is there another box for me to take or a? Oh. Quick, quick, quick. Okay. I don't know how that worked, but awesome. That moves that bridge. Probably need to push that there. This suddenly got pretty complex in a hurry, didn't it? Oh, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye, Rob Goblins. Oh, well that wasn't... That didn't feel like that was really worth my time. Well, let's see, a few more puzzles and we'll see if we can make our way through this area. But if not, I might leave this for another time. Though I've been really, this has been really enjoyable. You know, sometimes you just need something simple and fun. And this really, really has been putting a smile on my face the whole time. What more could you ask for in a game? We need all these things in order, huh? Okay. So one more time. We're gonna go here and here. That's still going around. Perfect. Nope, I missed. Hold on. Perfect. We're gonna get some water. Please. Thank you. That solves that issue. Oh. Ah, <laughs> uh, not that. Don't don't headbutt the keys into the water. That's that's not that's not helpful. Oh. However, you can headbutt the rob goblins into the water. That perfectly acceptable. Cross over the little, perfect, cute. And there's just a door on the other side. Doorway on the other side. More hedgehogs. Cutie little hedgehogs. Uh, this way to Nightingale City. Yingrid was here. My wonderful run into Yingrid, Yingrid at some point. Hey, 
Hey, this is Nightingale City. Word of your arrival is spread, Elephant and Queen Syntharia. Syntharia? Not sure about that one. Wishes to see you forthwith. Please proceed to the city. Hey. Oh, wow, you really are an elephant. We heard, we heard rumors the new elephant has come, but I didn't know what to believe. Welcome to Nightingale City, home of the royal family and high seat of the kingdom. The queen wants to talk to you, and I suggest you seek her out in the castle right away. This is so exciting. They have very thin necks. And no face. Are they birds? Maybe they're birds. You know what? That would make sense. Nightingale. Oh, but that's a human. Well, here's me, though. Naga, the warrior pacifist. Oof, that's the... <laughs> if that's the path we were supposed to be taking in this video, I feel like I've failed. With the Rob Goblins, the, the Snokes... I, I, I'm, I'm gonna check <laughs> before we, before we leave this playthrough, uh, I am gonna check if that is a saying, <laughs> like a thing we're supposed to say, because it sounds like a very, um, not PC thing to say in, <laughs> in 2023. I'm just, I'm gonna take a quick peek to make sure I'm good. Seems like we're good. I mean, obviously it's a, it's a Star Wars thing? Yes, okay. Supreme Leader Snoke. Kind of forgot about him. All right, we're learning. Maybe it's a Star Wars thing. <laughs> kind of forgot about that one. Anyway, well friends, thank you so much for joining me. That was adorable. I'm so happy we, that the random number gods had Yono for us today. Uh, that was really fun. I I bet the charm, I hope the charm continues throughout the whole adventure. Maybe I'll give it a go on stream sometime. Uh, that had potential. That was really cute. Well, I, I really enjoyed that one. All right. Well, I think that's gonna do it for me for uh, this week. So once again, thank you so much. What do I, what, how do I do outros again? So, <laughs> so I love you all so much. Thank you all for being such lovely members of my streaming family. Uh, feel free to subscribe, ring the bell, leave a like, leave a comment. Thanks for being here. I'll see you really soon, friends. Bye. I can't tell the truth. Even though it takes courage to capture a dancer The things I fear the most Between you, between me and